hello youtube uh, it's been a couple of months since i posted a de some new content um obviously christmas and my real job and just being inundated with leather work i just haven't had a chance to do any new uh, leather videos and belt videos but i finally finished six or seven replica re leathers today so i thought i'd um do a bit of content before I start my next batch of work. So here we have a European replica uh, WW shop belt that's actually now discontinued or it's just not available on the stores anymore. Um, I dropped on a really good deal for this off one of my uh, belt groups that I've got. Um, so I thought I'd keep the replica strap so I can do send outs and things like that with it. So I decided to re-leather this. So let's get into it. Got some beautiful four or five mil replica plates with a nice little curve on it. Um, World Wrestling Entertainment rather than World Wrestling Federation for obvious reasons. Um, I'm hoping that they might do a block logo version of this at some stage. Be very easy for them to do just to change that logo out. Um, I'll use the JMR shell tooling around the edge as you can see around the perimeter of the strap nicely beveled edges also that carries on all the way around the top and bottom uh, for the snap boxes i used a plain 2x8 jmr press plate which would have made this, this was just all plain in, initially after that, but I decided to go over it with a, um, a shading stamp just to give it that little bit more definition there. I've also got an updated um, D-Rip Belts logo as well. Uh, over on the other side, two by five. Again, went over it with the shaded, uh, leather stamp and another d rip belts logo that end has obviously no jmr um tips over on the back of the belt just went for plain black all the way around all screws covered also Sealed edges all the way around. Beautiful belt. This one, the, the leather's really flexible already for a brand new strap. Super flexy. This belt is actually for sale. Um, you can find it on my um, website or just message me on my social media pages. Uh, it'll be 450 for this one. Basically, I paid 150 for the plate, the belt originally, and it's just 300 pound extra for my uh, standard leather price. Uh, the belt also has a belt bag with it, so it's the complete package. Bargain really at 450 for a fully re-leathered belt, especially to this standard. Um, I'll see you on my next belt review. Thanks for tuning in.